Hello and thank you for watching this video. This one is about me converting a SEMA X5C1 drone into a little action camera for my Sky Surfer remote control plane. This is not the controller for the plane, but the controller for the camera, so you can activate it while the plane is flying using the little camera record button down there. The case is made out of aluminium and there's a separate case underneath it where the battery goes so the battery friction fits and is removable and replaceable this is the original board from the drone and in order for it to work properly there has to be an SD card in this back slot inside the camera here that's why there's a little bit of folded up the aluminium that I use is really cheap because it came from the bottom of two Pringles cans and that also makes it really lightweight because it's so thin. Enjoy this video if it works. So here is a little closer look at the camera. So the lens is glue using hot glue from a glue gun attached to the front of the metal case that I made and the power cable comes out there. The on and off switch is on the top and as you've seen before, the SD card is in here, so if I press it, you can hear it click and then it comes out, and then I can put it back in. To watch, it, watch the recording, I can slot it into here and plug this into the USB port on my laptop. The actual camera itself was very simple to build, I built it in one day, and... The metal is so thin that it, I could work it by hand and using pliers and I just used a pair of scissors to cut it. And you could also see the little bit of foam board there to keep the camera at the correct angle so it's as low as it possibly can be without the front bit of the canopy being in view of the camera. So that worked out well. And this is the also the battery hatch for my plane so I can be flying along and have aerial footage filming using this. Because it came from a drone that only cost about £25, the camera quality is not the best, it's something awful like 2 megapixels and 720p. But it's good for a little basic action camera that's relatively lightweight. It runs on its own separate battery as you can see, which is this little one cell battery mounted inside there. It's a 500 milliamp hour battery and when flying the drone it would last about 5 to 10 minutes. So I'd like to think the camera would last a bit longer than that because there's no power that's needed to go to the motors. I did have a few problems with it however. First I mounted the camera a little bit further back and that made it impossible to get the SD card in and out. And it also means, because the camera has to be mounted for the force to get the SD card out, you can't put this canopy on properly, it has to be, you can kind of see the camera is lifting up the bubble at the front, so you can't tape it down properly. But that's okay, because the F going over it will help keep it cool. Enjoy this clip of it flying.